Hello and welcome back to your channel. Uh, I'll try to make a quick explanation of why I've been away from YouTube uh, for a few months now. Um, you probably know what's going on in Iran right now. There's a revolution going on in Iran for uh, the human rights, the basic human rights. And uh, I really couldn't uh, have that, you know, kind of power to make content and be there with the full energy that I always had. Even now, I don't actually have that energy, but I just didn't want to stay inactive. Uh, I just gathered my shit together uh, in these uh, days and tried to actually make some content and start making content again. Uh, I had like eight parts before, I mean, after this part, uh, for the whole Watch Tech series. Um, but after the eighth part, which would be the ninth part, uh, there would be new episodes, new content, which takes place now. I'll probably record, record it after this one. Uh, so make sure to tune in for the, those. And uh, sorry for my inactivity over the past few uh, months it's been rough for me for my family for everyone in my country and I had to be a part of it I had to be a part of this history and I couldn't just stay away from it and just you know not make any kind of uh, activity over the past few days and we have lost a lot of people I'm I just don't want to get into the political stuff in my channel, but uh, I hope everything goes well for my community, for my country, for my people, for my uh, for our women in our country. And uh, that's all I have to say and all I can say. I have a lot more to say, but I have a situation, as I've mentioned many times before in my videos, I can't speak much in uh, politics issues in Iran, so uh, I'll try to stay away from them as much as I could in YouTube and in social media. Uh, and I'll probably let you guys know why in a few months when I'm actually done with it. The people that are close to me probably know what's going on, but uh, I just can't mention it at the moment on the social media because I don't want in trouble more than this. Uh, so thanks for giving me your three minutes of your time. Um, I'm back. Sorry, I should I should be sorry if I can't offer you the same energy as before. Uh, I've been going through a lot lately. Uh, and I'll probably take it. I mean, make a video about it in a few months. And I'll try to explain everything further. But uh, that's probably uh, enough explanation. Uh, let's just jump into the game. So remember, these recordings are for uh, like before the whole inactivity. So uh, the new ones would be the ninth part and the one the parts after that. And that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching, and I hope in I hope you enjoy the new. Uh, Gameplay, which would be the main uh, Watch Dogs story uh, gameplay, and I'll try to walk you through everything that's been going on in the game and everything that you have to actually witness and watch to enjoy the game. Thanks for watching, stay tuned. All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back with uh, a new episode, which is uh, obviously the Watch Dogs Legion, the main game itself. We're done with the Bloodline. Uh, it can be found in another playlist, which is found in our channel, of course. So uh, feel free to check it out if you're uh, interested to know what happened before the main game story and how uh, we dealt with Rampart and how Albion come in, uh, came into the, this story. So, uh, I won't talk too much, let's just get uh, into the game and dive into the whole main story of the 
Wild Circus Legion. Uh, I'm happy to have you with me. Let's do it. All that music, theater, and art, and multiculturalism, and the world's oldest underground, the tube. The class of cities, really. Top shelf stuff. Only took 12,000 years to build it up, and one night to tear it all down. <laughs> Our status. Perimeter security's down. Plenty of your flying friends about. Oh, fucking hell. Dalton, no time to waste. Yes, ma'am. Right, as far as I know, uh, we're not just one character in Western right. Legion. Um, and you know what's Legion what about. So. If you haven't brushed off, I might ever consider leaving these security threats to the authorities. That's rich, Bagley. The government would sooner arrest us for trying to help than actually do something useful. We'll have to sort this one on our own. Carefully, Dalton. Bagley, are you detecting a little worry in Sabine's voice? Brilliant. Asking the computer about feelings. This explains so much. Shut it, you two, and get to work. There she is. All right. So this is where we take over. Yeah. So we're starting as Dalton, uh, an agent who works for. Oh, uh, hello. That hurt you more than it hurt me. Okay. Well, it pretty much works like. Uh, light line itself, so I think we should, we should be Do fine. Do us a favor and keep it quiet, Dalton. If they don't shoot me, I won't shoot them. How's that? I don't see no one. That I can hear someone. This is kind of odd, but okay. Where are you? Ah, there you are. Hello. Okay. That's a nice way to die. <laughs> Alright, so there goes the terminal. We have a camera over there. Their profiles are heavily encrypted. No identifying information. Nice. Ghosts in this system. So do we have the no we don't. I thought this guy has a drone too, but apparently it does. So we gotta do it on foot. What? For someone else? It's on top, maybe. No, uh, there's this drown over here, but I don't think we could get this to work. Sorry. I've got loads of dead set gear down here. Now, why do you suppose that is? What? How did they get their hands on it? I don't know. But someone wants to make it look like dead set was here. Shit. You need to proceed with extreme caution, Dalton. Oh. Well, that's Who are a these men in black anyway. Nothing nice identifying. I suspect kind of that's by history. design. Okay, let's go. I think we're done here. Oof. 
Fuck me. The entire place is rigged to blow. Jesus, those canisters. Badly is that... RDX nitrogen, enough to level Parliament. Can you locate a detonator, Bagley? Not exactly, but there's a device streaming a fuckload of encrypted data from the floor above you. Yeah, that fits the bill. On my way. Bagley, is that not the detonator? No, but it's a transmitter sending a signal to a device on the floor above us. Safe to assume that would be the detonator we're looking for. Damn, Dalton is a dead set propaganda all around the bombs. These pricks are gonna blow up Parliament and hang you up. Not if you get to that detonator first. Nice one, Dalton. Oops, sorry about that. Right in the House of Commons. Whoever these men in black are, they've got brass bollocks to set up in the center of government. Probably better be careful with this. I found the detonator. And it's definitely live. Bagley, I'm gonna need some help with this. Yes, you are, but sadly, I'm locked out. Fuck. Well, we don't have a chance without Bagley. Wait, Wait. I might know a workaround. We trained in manual overrides at MI5. You're full of surprises. Be quick about it. All right, Bagley, do your thing. I'm in. And the bombs have just armed themselves. Well, that may complicate matters. For fuck's sake. Can you defuse them or not? Of course I can. But I might also trip another failsafe and vaporize you, so fair warning. I expect this to draw some attention your way, Dalton. Oh, I'm counting on it. Company at our back door. Shit. Dalton, we've got some heat here at HQ. How long is this going to take, Bagley? Depends how often you interrupt me with questions. All right, everyone. Faces on, guns out. It's about to get real. <laughs> Fuck. They're on me. I'll try and hold them off. Alright. Now, this is a way to go. Keep your eyes open. Clear! Head and out! Bagley, update! Let's just say I'm both impressed and annoyed by how sophisticated this anti tamper security is. <clears throat> Still working! <laughs> Bagley, tell me you're close! I'm through security, now wading through terabytes of decoy code looking for the detonation sequence. Come on, I'm hitting your head. Of course you do. I feel like... <laughs> As I was, I feel like uh, the John Wick moments. That shot. Or another shot. Are they done? Ah, oh, come on. I expected more from you guys. Oh, sorry. Come on now.
Is that it? Was it easy? Problem, Dalton. I need your physical appendages now. Sure. Why not? What's wrong? There are three slots on the left. One of them is the receiver. You need to pull the controller wire. Are you fucking kidding me? No, I'm fucking not. Pull the wire. If this gets me blown up... <sighs> Bombs defused. <laughs> See? That wasn't so bad, was it? Ugly, you bastard. You nearly gave me a bloody heart attack then. <laughs> whoa, 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 what the fuck am I looking at? It appears Parliament is not the only target. More bombs are going live as we speak. On screen, Bradley. Fucking hell, we need to get the word out. Those sites need to be evacuated. They're spread out all over London. There isn't any time. But my sister's at the town conference. We have to do something. I picked up a transmitter on the roof that is sending out a signal to the other bomb sites. If you can reach it, I can shut it all down. Sabine! Fuck! Dalton, we're breached! Go! The roof! Um. How do we go to the roof? Sabine, what's going on? We're being raided! It's a bloodbath. A protocol is to wipe everything, including badly. I need him for the transmitter. I know, but if they get him, they get everything. Names, ops, locations. Okay, I'll do it the old-fashioned way. Wipe him. Yes, wipe me. Do it, Sabine, and get the hell out of there. Fuck. Okay, Bagley's down. You're on your own. Dalton, this goes. It won't. I'll see you at the rally point. I promise. Good luck. Oh, come on, this is too hard. Come on, can we have anything to blow up? Oh, nice. Dude, you've got your head sh Shit. shot at for like three times. Yeah, it's too late. But I like the, the fact that he realized that he's alone and he's on his own. That was a cute one. Exactly. To save the world. You do know Londoners have died before. Hmm? The plague, the great fire, the blitz. There's not much fun. But destruction is always the cure. And it begins today. Zero day. Oh god. It's time for a hard reset. Oh my god. Excuse me? I didn't catch that at all. Okay. Get it back. Sorry about that. Hmm. Let's go. A series 
of explosions devastated three sites in London. Authorities are asking residents to remain in their homes as the situation continues to develop. We have received no official casualty total, but it is expected. This evening, mourners gathered for a series of candlelight vigils that brought closure to thousands of families and indeed to an entire city. London is now laser focused. And Downing Street, where Nigel Cass, CEO of private military company Albion, received a mandate to secure London. Cass has vowed to hunt down dead set the terrorist group responses to their laws. Albion used cutting edge artificial intelligence systems and autonomous drones to capture the remaining members of dead sec. A stark warning to would be insurgents. Corporations are posting record profits. Oh, that's a due nice to way to start. Efficiencies in production and distribution, enabled by the use of technologies initially developed and approved for security purposes. A long overdue cleanup as crime numbers take a dive. Illegal gambling, drug trafficking, and prostitution all down following prosecutions of the leaders of four of London's five largest criminal syndicates. The streets of Camden. is extended indefinitely by the government, life finally begins to return to normal. Curfews and travel restrictions have been lifted in all boroughs thanks to the deployment. News outlets, reports of rioting in Trafalgar Square have been greatly exaggerated, possibly by foreign meddlers pushing a false narrative through social media. Albion is in complete control of a new about the circulation of fake news, conspiracy theories persisting in dark corners of the internet that terrorist group DeadSec were framed for the bombings have been roundly rejected. Our own reporters could not find a single Londoner willing to expound those theories on camera. The facts simply do not support any other story. That's a nice way to start the game. So the whole death sack was uh, framed for the whole bombings. I guess it might be anonymous behind it, but I'm not sure. Team, Let's see what I happens. Can't reboot dead sack alone. Let me break into London CTOS and see who's available. <coughs> I'm Claire Waters, and we've been discussing the hacktivist, now alleged terrorist group, DeadSec, on this week's Buccaneer Radio. I have Colin calling in. Colin, what's your take? Now, I've been saying from the start we should have round up DeadSec and thrown them in jail. Now, I'll say they should all be lined up and shut. You don't find it awfully convenient that they've been fingered as the attackers, but we've seen no proof. Look at town! Look at our city! What more proof do you need? Well, Colin, I'd say you have to look at their history of non-violent action. Albion's put more civilians in the hospital in the past few months than DedSec ever has. I smell a scapegoat. Now I have Emily calling in. Emily, what's your take? You're absolutely right, Claire. The government's just framing DedSec because they want to make it seem like they have this under control. They probably have no clue who was behind the bombings. But that doesn't look good on the news, does it? DedSec's been a thorn in their side. Who better to pin it on? Angie, I have you next. What do you make of all this? I think if anything, dead sex showed their true colours. It's terrifying to think we harboured such a dangerous element for years. Terrorists in our own backyard. Do you find dead sex more frightening than the different gangs in London like Clan Kelly? Clan Kelly might set your shop on fire and maybe they'd kill you, but even they wouldn't try to blow up all of Parliament. Next, I have Crypto King. Shit, the situation is worse than I thought. Brilliant. Let's get the people of London on board. Hmm, so I'm not sure how, I mean, what we're supposed to do with these people. Okay, we could pretty much use police contact.
drone to tray hack, that's a good one. Last downloads, that's kind of nice. I don't usually use drones. This guy has a unique weapon. Dart gun, let me see that. 58, Doctor. Mm hmm. She's a tank, I would say. Uh, take place damage in short injury time. <clears throat> okay. Guess the aversive... Uh, Dodge could help, but paint's book on I mean this is pretty much better than anything I could think of at this moment, so let's good to go. I just hope that we could get stuff like MP5s and such in the progress of the game, because I don't think I could do it without like the MP5 and everything. Oh, he doesn't have any Glad to weapon see you at all. If you're still committed to the cause, DedSec needs you. I'll send you the coordinates to our last safe house. Meet me there. Fine. Oh, it's London. I could never get used to this, I guess. <laughs> this is pretty much embarrassing, but yeah. It's weird. Come on, why, why do people... Drive on the left side. I find it really weird. I've downloaded a patch to your optics so you can access our security system. It's set up so that I can't just let someone who isn't dead sec in. You'll have to do the manual override. Smart move having redundant systems like that. Can't trust anyone, right? It's cute, wait. One of Sabine's, are you? I'll see you downstairs later then. Oh, she. The well, yeah. This is what you wanted, mate. Get to it. Yeah, okay, that's nice. Hmm. Sabine. Right, where's the fucking light switch?
Insect Registration Detected. Identify yourself or I'll seal the exits, hack your optic, and read you every drunken email you ever wrote until you starve. Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! It's alright. I'm supposed to be here. Uh, authorization code... Sabine sent me? Sabine's <laughs> alive? Well, that's one piece of good news. I'm Bagley, DedSec's definitely not stolen, highly advanced AI assistant, and it seems I've been out of commission for a few months. Anyway, why don't you go connect me to the DedSec network so I can become more powerful than you could possibly imagine. I mean, catch up on what I missed. this now? Mm-hmm. Can't do that either. Oh, we're... nice. I was up there just now. Come on. Are we supposed to do that, though? it. I'm reconnected to the network, downloading our database, news archives, and oh, 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 oh no, terrorist group DedSec responsible for deadly bombings in London, Dalton Wolf dead? I leave you people alone for a second and you immediately cock it all up. <laughs> Sounds like a proper conspiracy, Bagley. Who was really behind the bombings then? There's a gap in my memory after Dalton, well, let's be honest, after I disarmed the bomb at Parliament. I'm missing information about what happened after I was taken offline. But from what I can infer, an unknown hacker group identified only as Zero Day was involved. I believe this Zero Day staged the attacks and framed DedSec for their dirty work. Come to my terminal. Sabine is requesting a video call. Hmm. Patching in Sabine Brandt now. I suggest you listen very closely to anything she has to say. There you are. I'm glad you made it. Bagley. God, it's good to hear your demented little voice. Is your memory intact? Not even slightly. The last record I have is of our HQ being raided. My only lead is a group known as Zero Day. Ring any bells? No. But the HQ was attacked by some men in black. The same that were at Parliament. Maybe working together. We didn't stand a chance. They just gunned everyone down. Fuck, that's mental. You were lucky to get out alive. I managed to escape through the sewers to Camden. A contact smuggled me out of the city and I've been hiding out in the north since. Prudent. Your profile is red flagged as a high priority target in the city's surveillance system. Even a partial recognition here would have you hunted down and shot on sight. <sighs> yeah. About that. I'm guessing that if I join up, that kind of attention extends to me, right? Christ, Sabine, it's fucking risky. Listen, if anyone knows anything about risks, it's me. I lost everything and everyone. But it comes down to this. London is in a death spiral. And if DedSec can't pull it out, trust me, no one can. The city needs a resistance. And it starts with you. What do you say? I'll say, Amir. Say what the hell. Let's get to it. Excellent. New user registered. Welcome to DedSec. Now, it would be irresponsible of us to release you naked and mewling into the wild. <laughs> You'll find equipment around the safe... Okay. ...house that are essential items in your DedSec kit. I mean, we need both of them. Oh, it, it's, it's able to do takedowns. That's kind of nice. 
Well, we're going to see... Oh, okay. But we have to do it. Yes. All I got with the invisibility cloak. If you ask me, this is going to be a lot more interesting. Your operative in the team menu. No. Gadget. Whip. We have a sophisticated system for hiding your identity from facial recognition tech. It's called a mask. And while we're here, perhaps we can talk about updating your wardrobe. I mean, look at you. Come on. This is more, a lot more interesting, but this gives a good look to this guy. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, You've got all these fancy new toys, but it's also important to know the basics. You need to learn how to throw a punch and how to take one. Albion will escalate if you come at them with a gun and shoot you down. We want to avoid collateral damage. In DedSec, we try to use guns only as a last resort. Have you already met Connie Robinson? She owns the pub and is an old DedSec contact, not to mention a champion amateur boxer. Go to the practice ring and she'll show you how to stop flinching when someone cocks a punch at you. I'll be back. Okay. Let's start with some basic strikes. Hit me. Don't be shy. You want to get in under my block. Find the weak point. Couldn't have done that better myself. That's it. Okay. Quick on your feet now. You want to create distance. have done that better myself. Couldn't have done that better myself. That's a great one. Oh, okay. but okay <sighs> easy. there's only one more skill you need to master socialization the rest of your team has arrived why not go and have a chat hello there welcome to the team yes I'm ready to go bastard hunting with you lot. <laughs> That's a nice way to start. A lot of nice things in the game. I love it. You alright? Listen, um, are you sure I belong here? What if recruiting me was a mistake? I don't even know how to be dead sec. Learning on the job's the way to go. Now that you're all as thick as cyber thieves, Sabine would like to talk to you. Well done, team. It's good to see the safe house filling up again. The only way we're going to keep London from falling into total oppression is by rebuilding the resistance. We need to recruit, train, Build back our arsenal. The people are itching to rise up and take their city back. 
We just need to show them that dead sec are fighting along with them. That's all well and good, but it's the power brokers that need to be brought down. Let's not forget Albion. There's a literal army occupying the city. I won't stand for that. Meanwhile, Clan Kelly has risen to the top like rotten cream. They need to be brought down. Fair, but remember that this zero-day hacker group is still out there. They took out DedSec once, and it's a good bet they'll try again. I believe they were responsible for the bombings and framed DedSec. With your help, I plan to get to the bottom of this mystery. I'd say that's a full docket. Enough talk. Let's unfuck London. <laughs> Let's do it. First order of business. The Signals Intelligence Response Service, or SIRS, or the Earl Grey Gestapo, have developed a surveillance technology called AR Reconstruction. It's the bleeding edge of privacy rights violation, and thus it could be very useful in our attempts to... Zero day. some damage control to do if we want to change the perception that we're a bunch of violent thugs. I'll let you be the judge of how best to handle yourself, but remember, you represent DedSec now. Right, go on. Resistance group requires operatives with special. He's gone to port, hasn't it? Interested in maybe changing things for the better? You're dead sick, aren't you? Well, have I got some juicy information for you lot? Go on. A few weeks ago, my entire division got sacked, yeah? All 300 of us? But what's even. Go for that. A tech corporation acting unethically? Sounds out of character, but let's investigate anyway. I'll check it out. Alright, let's see how we could get to those points. Okay, okay. It's really waiting for us to deactivate that thing. Right? No? Come on. Ah, okay. Oh. 
Kind of hard. So, <laughs> so how do we actually get rid of that? Okay. Dang it. The comrade is now taking an Albion mandated timeout. You're up. Oh, wonderful. Another mess for me to clean up. Your somewhat reckless teammate has got themselves thrown in the old clink, I'm afraid. Difficult to resist oppression from behind bars. It will be a while before they're available. Pro tip, however. Why not recruit a barrister to the team? I mean, no one exactly likes a barrister, but they do have their function. They should be able to shorten the jail time of imprisoned operatives. How do we get up there, though? Is it supposed to do that? Now that's how you do it. Yes. Guess we don't have much of a choice. see me did you I'm not even here anymore Are you sure Are you kidding me okay okay this guy is
Oh, finally. All units, I repeat, all units. We have reports of a hostile in your area. Over. Message received, moving. Where's my guy? Are you serious? Control the target's vehicle. Now, this is what we need. Someone that could help us out of legal snaffles. I ro well, don't you have a feisty look about you? Don't worry, I'm not coming on to you. Unless, of course, you're into it. Fuck me! Are you dead <laughs> sick? I could use your help. Uh huh. Tell me your secrets, then I'll tell you mine. What's the deal? It's these Clan Kelly dipshits. Planted drugs at my mate's home. Got him detained. Well, we gotta scratch their back before they scratch ours. So I guess I should help out Naomi first. I've got coordinates for the two suspects. Scrape their optic data. That should give us more than enough to incriminate them. Hello there. Uh, that's a nice ass of Martin. Oh. Guess this is an... This is a dead end. But let's see. Look what you've done with my car. Oh, you serious? Ay, ay, ay.
One of the gangsters whose optic data we're looking to scrape is nearby. There it is. You can hack in from there. That's one criminal straight. Now let's see about their friend. We have like drones and stuff. Okay, um, I mean, we just now looked at the skies versions. Data already, but it's not working for some reason. Which is pretty much annoying if you ask me. Okay. Guess I gotta get in. Oh, You guys come from? Oh, damn. Shooting me? What is shooting? Oh, come on, mate. All units, possible suspect or suspects reported near your location. Received. All right. This dude is actually outside. Take an order of magnitude. I managed to trace their encrypted comms channel back to a remote server. Seems like a good spot to dig up some info. I mean, if you ask me, we've come so far, killed a few of them. So why not just get in and get the mask? Ah, oh, come on. 
that was not supposed to happen, but it happened, so why not? You gave the single, you know what? Bye. Oh, hello. That's for showing me the way down. Come on, what the heck? I've done it all for a mask. Who's just here? Thank you very much. Oh, nice mask. Who's shooting who? Come on. Whoa. Suspect has a firearm. Watch your eyes. Okay. Right, close this fucker down. There's a car guard here. Suspect is unsighted, unsighted sweeping area. Right though. Don't proceed. See anything. Returning to HQ, over. I mean, I'm pretty sure they made it uh, possible for us to actually get things done without getting inside. You know what I mean? Like, everything to be done from outside of the house or the building with just cameras and stuff. How did we get there? Oh, is it outside?
London, I give you art. Oh yeah. So outside there, there's a pipe What's that the we point could find by. Out there if you don't get any credit for it, haste ups let the people of London know that DedSec is back, and the increased visibility might even encourage some of them to donate to the cause. Okay, cool. Where are you stuck? Let me help you out. Suspect. Just help them out, come on. You see me? Use a pursuit intervention technique. Ah. Cool, I have eyes on the firearm over. And I'm gone. Oh. Control, we have a visual on the suspect. Control, I've lost the target. Oh, very good. All clear here. Moving on. Albion's authority keeps London safe. I'm terminating the search. Fall back. Over. Why, mate? Interesting. Well, don't you have a feisty look about you? Don't worry, I'm not coming on to you. Unless, of course, you're into it. You're dead sick, aren't you? Maybe you can help me. I'll have a look at our schedule. What's wrong? Okay, that's cool. So, we could just run into people uh, and recruit them. So what are those? Okay. Oh, that's good. The demands of being a dead sec operative are all consuming. So taking app gigs is a good way to make some extra quid that works around your new schedule. Lots of people will pay well to have their sensitive packages handled with care. And some will even pay you for deliveries. Ha ha. Okay, don't mind if I do. We need to get the job done. Oh, we, we're on one hour already. Okay, let's just get there and uh, and then we'll just finish this episode here. I mean, there. So our teammate is out, yeah? Sorry. How are you supposed to get in there? I don't 
Mm, the map. Oh, there's a long way to it. So, okay, I'll just finish this episode right here on this nice looking bridge with this nice looking car. Uh, thanks for being with me. I hope you're gonna enjoy this gameplay and walkthrough because, uh, as far as I know and I've seen, uh, this game is pretty much a great deal. And a nice thing, let me see. Team injury, this, this is cool. Oh, sorry, no. I didn't mean to do that, sorry. Come on, sorry, sorry. Ah, I ruined it. Well, uh, it's a cute thing, honestly. Because you could just run around and bump into some people that you could recruit and uh, use for your shorter okay cool alright so that's pretty much it Thanks for watching and being with me. I hope you guys enjoyed this gameplay with me in the future. Uh, I'll try to bring it to you guys as soon as possible because I am hyped for it. I pretty much love the Watch Dogs series uh, so far. So thanks for being with me. Bring it out.